Greetings Taurus, um, welcome to your horoscope. So you know, we're in the part now where it's Vedic Leo as well as um, you know, Western Astrology Leo, so in your fourth house, deep in there, ancestors, your heritage, but all these planets in, in Virgo, in your fifth house. So the, the focus we're heading towards here is about using your creative expression, being there for your children, um, being there for your lovers. You know, what is it to be a lover? To be a good lover to others, you have to be a good lover to yourself. What does that mean? You know, it's different things to different people. Sometimes we're in an incubation stage. We do not want to go out. We really don't want to see people. We want to just lock ourselves up and live in our fantasy world. And that's fine, because I mean, oftentimes, things can at times seem better in the fantasy world, but the real excitement is getting out there and meeting real people. And, um, And sometimes it's a meeting of the minds, but my favorite meeting is really the meeting of the hearts, you know, where, where you just you just love the person. And I think that's what we're meant to do, you know. I think one thing that we've got to learn here in Leo time is we're meant to be lovers. Lovers of the heart. And, you know, the more things you love, the more things you're grateful for, the better a quality of life you're going to have. There's no question about that. And... Um, I think you're grateful for a lot. I think good things are happening. It's a good time for travel. It's a good time for fun. Taurus, rip it up this week. <laughs> Tear it up. Plus, you got the moon, you know, on the day of the, con you know, you're going to be there. 